Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over how to use the hero's journey in your Doodly videos. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. If you're unfamiliar with the hero's journey, it's a common narrative arc found in stories around the world. You see it in movies, books, all kinds of things. It includes 12 stages, each of which we can represent using scenes in our Doodly video. So these are the stages here. You'll see your character moves from the ordinary world up here, goes through some adventures, and then returns eventually with the elixir, okay? Now, what does that have to do with Doodly? We're not gonna be doing the next Harry Potter. Well, you might be a real estate agent. So your home buyer goes on a journey and it looks something like this. They have a current living situation, like a cramped apartment. They want a dream home, but they're not sure about it. They don't know if they can afford it, but they meet with a real estate agent and they find, yeah, they could get pre-approved and start looking at homes and they might have some challenges along the way. And then they're gonna find their ideal home and start going through the ordeal of making an offer and negotiating it. And then their reward might be, you know, they got approved for the loan, everything's happening. They start closing the deal and they move in. And then finally they make their house a home. Okay, so we can do that in Doodly. So let's just take a look. So you'll see here, I've already created the scenes and I'm just gonna show you a little bit. So here we are where we're introducing our hero. Let's call her Sarah. Sarah's comfortable in her current apartment, but she dreams of owning a beautiful house with a backyard for her dog, Max. So I think we've illustrated that fairly well here. So that's our ordinary world. And then when she starts dreaming of the house, that's our call to adventure. But at first she's hesitant. She worries about the cost and the process of buying a home. So what is this? This is her refusal. She's resisting. She's like, I can't afford it. No, nope, not, not for me. But then she meets with a real estate agent. She wants to find out a little bit more, right? So the agent reassures her and explains the process, talks maybe about some of these uh, low down payment loans and lets her know it is possible. So what is this? This is her meeting with Yoda. This is her mentor. So she gets pre-approved for a loan and she begins her house search in earnest. This would be her crossing the threshold. She is going for it, but nothing's easy, right? It wouldn't be a good story if she just got the house. So she's got to have some obstacles in the way. So Sarah visits various houses and she encounters a few setbacks. So maybe a house she loves is too expensive or maybe someone else bought it before she could make an offer. So these are what? Her tests, allies, and enemies. But finally, Sarah finds a house and she loves it. It fits her budget. Everything is perfect. So she approaches the agent to make an offer. What is this? This is her approach to the inmost cave. <laughs> and of course, nothing's ever easy. She's got to go through an ordeal and that's negotiation. You know, this is going to be a tense process for her. So that's her ordeal, negotiation. And, but eventually her offer gets accepted. And what do you think that is? That's her reward, okay? So now she's on the road back. She got her loan approved. She's heading towards the ultimate goal of getting this home. So right here is her road back. But roads can be bumpy, right? She's got some more things that are happening. Maybe the house has a leaky faucet. Maybe it failed the pre-inspection. So there's still some little bumps and bruises along the way. So here she is, she's got a leaky faucet and either she hired a plumber or she managed to convince him, hey, let me fix it myself, I don't know. But anyway, there is the road back. Okay, we're almost coming back with the elixir and here it is. So she's finally, she moved in and she starts making her house her own. She's painting the walls, she's setting up furniture, planting a garden, playing with her dog Max in the backyard. She's home and she has returned with that magical elixir. And there you have it. That's the hero's journey in the context of the home buying process. You can use this formula for virtually any videos that you want to create. Just think of your buyer, what their journey is. Remember, they're the hero, so they're going to start somewhere just in their ordinary life. 
and then something's going to happen to call them to adventure and they're going to go through all of these different steps before they finally get what they're looking for and using doodly you can help illustrate that okay i hope this gives you some ideas thank you for watching mm -hmm.